Hi, Greg the Bricktech here. This video will be taking a look at a mock I designed using pieces from LEGO Creator Set 5865 Mini Dumper, which was the last video that I did on my channel. I reviewed the 3-in-1 set, which had a dump truck, an SUV, and a race car. And what I like to do is, after I'm done building those, I like to make a design of my own, and that's what I did here. I'm titling this the Mini Pickup Truck. And typically, I don't really like to make uh, something that's too similar to the builds from the set. For example, they were all vehicles. In this case, I had to make a vehicle because the pieces were so limited. In fact, I used 51 of the 60 pieces on this pickup truck. And sort of what I tried to do here was make something that was like a vintage truck. It kind of looks to me like a 1950s style pickup. And I'll kind of take you around to show you what it looks like. Of course, in the front here, you have the very squared off front. I used this piece in here for the grill, and I thought that worked really well. The headline Typically, I'd like to use just a flat tile for those, but these ones kind of come out. It looks a little strange from the side, but when you look at it from the front, it's not too weird. Windshield is very similar to the dump truck. I uh, very limited pieces in that regard. And then on the side, you have a uh, side view mirror here. One thing that I would like to change here, you can see blatantly, is there was a fender piece for the front, but there wasn't one for the back because the dump truck really didn't have a back piece like that. So there is an opening here in the bed, and I'll show you that in a minute. Uh, another thing I wanted to change on this was this white going through here looks really good. I would have liked that white to continue the whole way back. It would look really nice to have that stripe going through. And you can see this little green bar that's in the front here. That's sort of like the front bumper. And I think it looks pretty good to set that green, and then you have the white, then the green again. But then in the back, not only do you have the missing fender, but uh, the bumper back here I kind of like too. It's sort of like uh, a nice design. You can see what I used here familiar with these pieces and I just kind of put another little extra piece to put it out a little bit further so it fits on there really well and it looks like a really good bumper. I've never done that particular design before but I think it's something I'll do in the future. Something else that's kind of weird about this is the tail lights are orange. There were no red tail lights in this so I had to use orange. You can't tell too much unless you look really close but it's all right. The back window I kind of like even though I didn't have the pieces for a back window. I made it work by using the parts that were for the side view mirrors and then I just kind of continued it across so it doesn't look too bad. It maybe looks like the back window is tinted or something like that. The bed of it looks pretty good. I didn't have any green pieces left for the bottom of the bed which I would have liked so I just kind of have those vents there or what I call vents. But overall it looks very symmetrical in terms of this being the same height as this and I think that looks really good and the roof looks nice. I'm overall very happy with this build. There isn't a whole lot that I would change about it. Just a couple things and if I had the extra pieces for from this set I would definitely change them or if I was making this on my own there's definitely some things I would change using all the pieces of my collection but I like the challenge of only using what's available and I think that makes it kind of fun and another thing is if you do have the 5865 mini dumper set and you build all three of those builds if you look at this build you can maybe make an extra one. So now it's a four-in-one build. So I kind of like to offer that to people that watch these videos because, you know, you might get bored. And if you don't have anything that you can think of to make, here's an idea for you. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about it. And I will see you in the next one.